No NFL football this Sunday, but we still have got Sundays with Serby. And this week, Steve Serby's Q&A was with the lead play-by-play -play voice for the NFL on Fox. That is Kevin Burkhart. And now, the legendary New York Post sports columnist. He's going to join me for a little Q&A. That's Steve Serby out here with the hoodie flannel going on. Two of your loves coming together. I like that, Steve. Thank you. Yeah, it's a relative new one to the uh, arsenal. There we go. We like that. We like when you're bringing a little bit of new fashion to Sundays with Serby. Now, taking it, taking it, taking it to Phoenix with me in in a few hours. Oh, I'm not. I'm, I'm not surprised. For those who know, Steve is heading out to the Super Bowl to come with my out Super there. Bowl, my Super Bowl haircut, of course, and a fresh cut. I forgot about that. So you just got all new attire. I, li I like this. I like this. Steve. It's all starting to come together for me. <laughs> <laughs> Finally, it's all starting to come together for you. Finally. Now, Steve, uh, you're going out to Super Bowl 57, and that's going to be the first Super Bowl for the former SNY reporter, Kevin Burkhart. Was this a lifelong dream for Burkhart to call this game, and how was he approaching his first opportunity to call the big game? Yeah, th this is a lifelong dream, and uh, what a great guy Kevin Burkhart is, as everybody at SNY remembers. Um, this guy is the natural whether it's a, as a sideline reporter for SNY in a kayak in McCovey Cove or uh, putting on a lab jacket trying to teach his audience about sabermetrics. Uh, he, he envisioned this day from the time he was doing Tecmo Bowl, uh, doing basketball or baseball all-stars on Nintendo. But here it is. And he's going to soak it all in. He's going to be in that booth drinking gallons of Dr. Pepper. He's going to be playing catch five or ten minutes before the game begins with his spotter, Mitch. He's going to treat it like just another game. But he knows deep down inside, after all the trials and tribulations of getting to this point, replacing Joe Buck and doing it seamlessly, he knows it's not just another game. It's surreal for Kevin Burkhart and good for him. One of the real good guys in this industry. Yeah, one of the and great, on this earth. Yeah, one of the great guys in this industry. For and sure, he was no doubt. I forgot to mention he was even he was a natural selling cars for Pine Belt Chevy. I mean, this guy just everything he touches turns to gold. Yeah, and I think he's going to have a golden standard performance calling Super Bowl 57. And we got to talk about him and his partner, Greg Olson. They've been working together as a duo for a little bit. So how does Kevin feel about the chemistry between the two? And what makes that duo work, Steve? Well, he uh, he covered Greg Olson when Olson was a, a, an all-star player uh, at Wayne Hills High School in New Jersey. He uh, and, and Olson back then was a great interview, according to Burkhart who interviewed him and his brother Christian. But these are two new North Jersey guys shooting the breeze in the playgrounds. That's the way Burkhart looks at it. Um, he credits Olsen for having a beautiful mind who can teach any viewer, whether it's a football fan or not, how to make the game of football understandable. And um, the thing about what makes this interesting is Tom Brady's retirement because Brady has that $10 million, I'm sorry, 10 year, $375 million deal from Fox waiting for him to be Burkhardt's sidekick. But uh, Brady is going to have tough shoes to follow because Olsen is just tremendous. And like you said, the chemistry between Olsen and Burkhart is off the charts. Uh, Olsen uh, is, he, he's going to have a job somewhere. Hopefully he'll stay at Fox when Brady decides to join the network. But uh, all, uh, Burkhart is so good at what he does that he'll do for Brady what Brady has been able to do for all of his teammates for 20 some odd years. And he'll make Brady better the way Brady made his teammates better. But in the meantime, enjoy the Burkhardt Olsen show because these guys are tremendous. And uh, I think the viewers will will enjoy their call. Burkhardt will bring energy and excitement and Golson will bring the knowledge and the chemistry will be easy to pick up because those two are just just tremendous together. They really are. I'm not a TV critic. Andrew Marshawn does that, but in my view, 
these guys are the real deal. And kudos to both of them. And kudos to Fox for pairing those two together. Yeah, great pair indeed. Kevin Burkhart will have the call for Super Bowl 57. Steve Serby, he will be at Super Bowl 57. We'll have coverage from Super Bowl 57 in Phoenix all week. He will be there. Steve, uh, next Sunday, we will not see you for Sundays with Serbia, I believe, because you will be out there covering the game. But we will uh, see you after the big game to talk about that. And everybody go check out Steve's Q&A with Kevin Burkhart. It's a really good one. Thank you, Steve. Off to Phoenix I go. Off you go. And uh, make sure you have the fresh haircut and the hoodie sweater there that we got, the flannel hoodie sweater. Got to have it. There you go. Thank you, Steve. Appreciate you, man. Thank you, Dex. <laughs>